Chiang is the future, you know, because eventually I and my age group will retire and fade into the sunrise or sunset or wherever we fade into. So when we have a Chiang personality in our university, the idea is to open the doors of opportunity for them so that they can spread their wings, find out what they like to do, find out what makes them happy. I mean, how can this help them? And in a way, how can it help the university or, or the researchers? I did not really start out as a researcher, but eventually I got involved with research here in Asia. And I like doing research which is uh, more applied in nature. I really like research that translates into the improvement of people's lives. This particular project with ACR, so I love it so much. <laughs> I have a brilliant team. I, I really enjoy working with them. They've got all the wisdom. They're old. <laughs> the, the value of seeing farmers' lives really improve and them telling you that story. I mean, things like that, they just inspire me. The motivation is the joy that you get. And that's the same motivation that you should find in every generation of young researcher. What makes them want to do the work that they they want to do. Partnering with Asia means that we can do our mandate to do research and publish. And then the idea is to to train enough leaders so that you render yourself unnecessary, so that they can be your multiplier effect in the in society. Yeah.